What are those common issues post reconstructive surgery? And I was trying to keep it general. So we can be talking about reconstructive surgery of any kind, whether it's post cancer or whether it's a cosmetic issue or whether it's a gender change surgery. Dr. Jacobs mentioned a couple of times frozen shoulders, medically known as adhesive capsulitis, tends to happen most commonly in women between the ages of 40 and 65. We don't really know exactly why it happens. We do know that it tends to happen after trauma, that that capsule gets really sticky and it really limits range of motion at the shoulder and causes quite a bit of pain. Rotator cuff issues sometimes present themselves. And I think that tends to be either a pre-injury or a compensation type of injury because they're using their body in a different way. We see a lot of pectoralis tightness and along with that, a lot of increased thoracic kyphosis. So if you think about any person, you might see any of this in, in somebody who's not had a reconstructive surgery and you wouldn't treat them that much differently, right? Uh, except that if they're really new, if the surgery is really recent, then there might be some precautions that would come from the doctor.